We gather today as regional and continental leaders to reflect on progress made in advancing the goal of greater continental economic integration towards the establishment of a grand African economic community. Why we are here now in Johannesburg is because we have the second tripartite summit which will then launch the negotiations for the establishment of the tripartite free trade area which we have now popularly uh, christened as the grand uh, free trade area. The summit that launched this tripartite process was held in Kampala in 2008 and over the subsequent years uh, the East African community has organized itself with the partner states to get ready for today's momentous uh, launch uh, of the free uh, negotiations on the free trade area uh, and so we've been very 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 involved. Yes, today 12 of uh, June 2011 is an important milestone for SADAC, Comesa, East African community, for Africa, and why not, to the entire world. Well, the summit uh, has endorsed um, a negotiation for a free trade agreement between the three RECs, um, and it's endorsed the roadmap, and it's endorsed a, a set of principles to guide the negotiations. And so um, I think that from now onwards, we're on a clock that's ticking, to complete the negotiation of a combined free trade agreement between 26 countries with a combined GDP of nearly 1 trillion US dollars and a population of over 500 million. We meet fully conscious of the collective responsibility we bear towards Africa's founding fathers to create a single continental market of real economic value. We are pleased, therefore, to gather as regional leaders today to witness and oversee the official launch of the tripartite negotiations. This is a special day, and it's a day we should celebrate, but we know there is going to be hard work ahead of us. A hard work in the negotiations, a hard work in the implementation. There is no way Africa is going to be globally competitive if we don't go through the route of regional integration. So this is for survival of the continent, this is for the competitiveness of the continent, this is for the transformation of the continent. As we embark on this work, we must redouble our efforts to build and rehabilitate regional infrastructure that must underpin production and trade growth. The work currently undertaken on the Nepad North-South Road and Rail Infrastructure Development Corridor is vital and to ensure that the work proceeds expeditiously and contributes directly to growth and development in the region. Our hope uh, is, uh, is to see the uh, speedy establishment of the tripartite, uh, the speedy uh, reaching of a full agreement on the grand tripartite free trade area, and uh, then beyond the agreement, the actual integration of the region. It is serious, it is happening. As I said, uh, these three regional economic communities, the common market for instance, Southern Africa, the Southern African Development Community and the East African Community, already they have achieved certain levels of integration. And all that the tripartite is doing is to build on that, then harmonize. There is a vision for United Africa. But Africa has also decided that in order to achieve that vision, they need building blocks. And the regional economic communities like mine, East African community, like SADC, like Comesa, are those building blocks. 
another step towards that vision of bringing these blocks together now into one uh, free trade area and eventually into one common market. So this is uh, careful work that is thought out within the bigger vision of an African economic community. I believe in my region, I believe in Africa, and I strongly believe that time has come for the Africans themselves to lead this process and to show to the world that yes, we know what we want, how, when, and how to do it.